Good morning, and welcome to Roy's the Boy. Uh, lovely sunny day again here in uh, Cambridge here. Uh, today's video, well, yesterday afternoon I went out and I had a look at uh, a mower for someone. They said it ain't starting, and it turns out I can see this is the carpet and needs uh, cleaning. All the cables are stiff and everything. Uh, they've had it for years and years. Uh, say about 15 years they've had this, and it's a little Harry with a Tecumseh engine on it. But what I've done, um, I've part exchanged it. Well, not yet. I've got to go and deliver the other one with another one. So let's go and have a look at it, and then I'll pop, do the video on the Harry doing a service on it. Okay, this is a little one. It's a little Harry model with the Tecumseh Prisma 37 engine. Have a look around it. The wheels very clear it seems very very tidy the machine but as you can see it's been sitting out all the winter this cable here is very stiff as if I see I did manage as you can see Put some WD-40 out of it last night, and it has now released that one very good. But the dead man's handle is very stiff. One <clears throat> I've just noticed, though. Actually, there's a kink in there, so I have to see if I can do something with that. See how we go. It's got quick release handles, which is quite good. And I think I will do very well on this one. That's it. Anyway, what I've actually part exchanged it for is this power force. Powerful's Garden. I think this is from um, Home Base. Same design base. I think <clears throat> this could be one of their models, which ain't too bad. I've sold. <clears throat> I've got ten pound on the um, little Harry video. Uh, video on the Harry mower. So that's going to be a very good. Well, Zemir, I'm going to show you some of my other mowers this one's a flamo silver quicksilver can it work and i've actually resprayed this one completely redone a refurb i didn't strip the old paint down all i did was uh sand it down and paint it over it with a, a silver and some lacquer <coughs> only cheap stuff and i've also <coughs> done the Handlebars all been resprayed. But the only thing I haven't got, I do not have the proper cable for the drive because it's it sits in there, but it's too long to go up there. I don't really want to cut it because it's a very good, nice cable. So I'm going to wait for that. I also have this Champion Self Road, self propelled, I should say. Mountfields, which I've done a partly restore on this one, and that just give the handles a little spray over, it makes it look good. And also, this one, which I did on the partly restore on the casing uh, and the deck, just done some painting on this bit here, which is blended in quite well as it happens. Over here, we still got the Atco to finish. And believe it or not, this one, this is our mower. This is what the wife bought a few years ago. Uh, and I still use it. It does have a, a hole in the deck just here. Uh, so it's, I don't know how long it will be lasting. So I'll probably end up using that for spare parts one day. But what I was thinking, I have got over here, I had an engine that was no good whatsoever. 
and I could pluck this, use this, on my mower. What do you think? Do you think I should just do that one and keep that? Because I've only got a small garden. It's not all that big. You can see down to the end. That is it. And the front garden. Anyway. That's enough for showing you then. Okay, right. It's early evening now. Uh, since I showed you around the little uh, Harry with the two country engine and uh, my tour of all the other stuff I had, I was going to make a start doing the, the Harry, getting that fixed and uh, getting it out ready for sale. But I got calls, uh, messages, people wanting to buy, uh, sell or even give me some more mowers. So I've, that day and afternoon, that's all I did. Uh, I went, went out and brought three more mowers back. I had two people come and buy mow mowers off of me. So it was a busy afternoon and it is all I could do. So I will be doing uh, another video on the Harry, getting it all sorted out and working done and everything. Uh, but it's just got too busy. What can you say? That's what that is really what you want, and that's, I'm really glad and happy about that. So, anyway, I'm gonna do a couple of shout outs to uh, Mick Mowers and uh, Little Riley. Good little channel, go and see them. And also, uh, Jacko's Small Engine Repair. Good on you, Jacko. I hope you can finish your shoot very good. The shoot, I should say. Uh, very good. And, uh, Go and see him as well. He's a good fella. Anyway, that's it from me. If you do like this uh, video and you want to see more, please like and subscribe or even share if you want to. And it's cheerio for me. So, happy days.